Hey guys, Azure 46 here and welcome back to Azure Mods. Today I'm just going to be showing you guys a little quick update we made to the Azure Mods mod launcher. So here you can probably tell the user interface looks a bit different, hopefully a lot nicer. Uh, so it's got all the games here. You can see when you hover over it, it shows you the view mods button. That's basically how you get back to the actual mods page where you enable mods and options and stuff. You can go back to games here. So, uh, the games at the start, these are the games you have installed and that we have mods for. And as you scroll down, uh, these are the games we have mods for that you don't have installed. And at the very bottom, these are the games that you do have but we don't have any official mods for. But you can still go ahead and click on it and make your own mods using the SDK if you want to. So another big feature that we've introduced during this update is this search bar here. So previously you'd have to scroll down and just try and hopefully find the game you're looking for. But now you can just simply search for it. So if I'd search for 60, you can see it's got these two games here. These are the games that we have mods for and that I have installed. This is the game I don't have installed, but there is mods available. And then these games I have, but there's no mods available. And you can see the same with this user interface on this side as well. So in addition to that search functionality and this new games panel here, we also have a new settings menu, a new settings option here called view update notes. So you can click on that and it shows you basically what we've done in each update. So you can see in the last update we added the search functionality for games, improved layout of the games page and some bug fixes. And you can also see the older posts and it goes through and you can see many 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 updates that we've done. So if you're interested in seeing what we actually do, this is a very good way to stay updated. And we also have a Discord you can join, and that way you can suggest mods, report bugs, and ask questions and get help if you need that. So thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you in the next modded video.